From Dagenham to Sierra Leone, Switch Expeditions is an alternative provision for young people struggling to cope in a mainstream environment. At Switch we have been studying English, Maths and ICT and also through outdoor expeditions based learning we have gained independence and life skills. Now we are heading to Sierra Leone to put our training to the test. First talk to Sierra Leone. Stop. It's <laughs> uh, very busy. Busy. Very. Lifestyle living conditions and even dress sense was a massive culture shock when arriving into the country. There's a real sense of community and everybody was loving and welcoming. This isn't something we are used to, seeing or experiencing living in Dagenham, so we found we had to adjust and adapt. Everyday life for me in Dagenham consists of being lazy, playing computer games and listening to music. My parents do a lot for me in terms of cooking and cleaning in the home. Visiting Sierra Leone, I noticed how independent all the young people are. Waking up so early around 5am to fetch water and clean the house. Go to school, then return home, clean the house again, prepare dinner and do laundry. We got involved and became part of the community by digging trenches and teaching in the local schools and nurseries. I made a conscious effort to be more independent in Sierra Leone. Be more active, waking up early, cleaning my shoe, cleaning my clothes, digging trenches and teaching in the local schools and nurseries. This was overcoming a big barrier for me as it was going out of my comfort zone and doing things I wouldn't usually or necessarily do in, need to do in Dagenham. Every day was a new challenge for us, from sleeping with insects and bugs in our room to refusing to quit and climbing down a forest to see a huge waterfall. Part of the expedition we visited a remote village called Ponderu. The raw basic living conditions and lifestyle was a real eye opener and made us realise how much we take for granted in Dagenham in our homes and everyday life. Seeing things like a youth centre being a hut and toilets in the home being a hole in the ground makes you appreciate things back home. After 10 days it was time to return home, back to reality but taking with us the memories and life-changing experience. But embed a new sense of purpose and motivation into my everyday life.